So you've got your Atari Flashback Portable and you like to add a, some games to it. Now I've had a few people ask me on the Arcade USA show, how do you add games to the SD card to be used on the Atari Flashback Portable? I did a search and there is a great Atari Age thread out there that I'll put a link to down in the show notes that you can go read up on the Atari Flashback Portable, how the, how the ROMs and and all this other cool stuff that the guys over at Atari Age put together all about this little system right here. Plus they got some ROM packs over there you can download as well that have been tested to make sure it works. Because some of the games are not compatible with the Atari Flashback Portable. A lot of great work was done over there. But anyway, so you got your little Flashback Portable. And you want to add one of your favorite games to it. Space Invaders, for example. I love the original Atari 2600 Space Invaders. It's never been put on a portable. The one I've only seen is on the flashbacks, which is that color Space Invaders thing that was specifically written. For some reason, they've never put the original Atari 2600 Space Invaders on any of the flashbacks, which I love that version of Space Invaders. So I'm going to add Space Invaders to my Atari flashback portable. But first, I'm going to need is an SD card. Now, I use SanDisk brand SD cards. Get one that's 8 gigabytes or smaller. Don't go to large cards because the system will not recognize larger SD cards. So I usually get 8 gigabytes. They're pretty easy to find. You can use it too. That works just as fine as well. Now if you have a problem where you got a, an SD card and the system is not recognizing it, there's a really good formatting utility that the guys over in Atari H found that's made by uh, <coughs> SD Associations. It's a really great SD card formatter. So you got to make sure you got this formatted in the correct way in order for the system to recognize it. It needs to be blank too. There's going to be one folder on here that we're going to create called Game, which I'll show here in just a minute. So now let's set up our SD card to have Space Invaders on it. Okay, let's plug in our SD card into the computer. And it'll pop up blank. So first thing we're going to want to do is create a new folder and we'll label it GAME. Again with the capital G then A-M-E. Pop! Just like that. Now we'll go to our download folder where we have our ROM. Right there it is. Space Invaders. So we'll extract that ROM into our game folder, just like so. And we'll come in here and we have to rename it. If it's all capitals like this, it will not work on the flashback portable. It will not recognize it. So you've got to begin with a capital letter and the rest of it has to be lowercase. So we're going to rename it, begin with a capital S, and then space invaders. There we go, just like that. So that's the format you want the bin files renamed to. So now we're ready to plug this thing into the flashback portable and give it a try. So there we go, we've got our SD card set up now with our game. So we're going to plug it into our flashback portable. Make sure we insert it the right way. Turn the unit on. Do, 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 do in a minute. Go over to SD card browser. And right there it is. Space Invaders. Boop. Oh yeah. Awesome. And I died. <laughs> so that's how you add ROMs to, to the Atari Flashback Portable. Thanks for watching. You rat. Like, like, take that, you. Thanks for watching.